Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to the Seven Stadium in Dubai. It's Fanco DCC X10 Division One, and the game that is just about to begin is Layari Kings taking on Vitak of Volts. And now this game is match number five of uh, the Fanco DCC X10. Well, there you have it. News from the center is Vitak Volts has won the toss and elected to field first. Four teams that have. Uh, Four matches that have been played before this. Teams that have batted first have won the game. Here we go, ball number one. Outside off. And just straight to the fielder. So, good start. Uh, and that's been pulled away towards mid-wicket. That's going to go to the boundary. That's four runs for Nile. Yes, a four for Nile Mohammed on the fourth Liari Kings would probably want to target 100 runs at least, just as a par score. As we see that ball gloriously played over cover, that's another boundary. Nile finishes off the over in style. You know, in how oh, that's been hit oh, towards mid wicket, and he's caught. The Mazar, the fielder, has done well to take that catch. Yard circle, Shoaib. So oh, that's played very well, and it's been caught. What a catch! And Leari Kings have lost their second wicket. And Aziz Ansari, uh, they're going to have to carry uh, a bulk of the innings to put up a reasonable score for the team. And that's been hit towards extra cover by Ali Tipu for a boundary. That was hit with a lot of power. Oh, this time, one shot too many from Ali Tipu using his feet. And Sakla and Heather gets a wicket. This is a two-paced wicket. Not the flat tracks we're used to in the air. And a catch taken. Sakla and Heather might have conceded a boundary off the first ball. Still no Sayyid Hasnain. Interesting batting positions. For the batsman here, driven through cover. That's a good looking shot. What a way to get off the mark. Stylish cover drive gets him four. Aziz Ansari has been watching the carnage from the other end. Goes through covers, up and over for a boundary. He's in sub sublime form, Aziz Ansari. We're just joining us. It was the VTAC Walls who won the toss and elected to field first. Short ball, sits up nicely, hit very hard towards mid-wicket. Back-to-back boundaries for Aziz Ansari. Mohammed Moiz, Vakar, he got off the mark with a beautiful cover drive. And oh, the story of the day continues. You cannot play across the line on this wicket. 61 for 5 -0. Beautiful shot there off the pads, clipped away nicely towards square. One of the best shots of the evening, Aziz Ansari gets a four. Face as many deliveries as possible. Nicely played, beautiful shot over extra cover. That is an absolutely brilliant shot from Aziz Ansari. Flighted delivery up and over, hasn't middled it. They will look for two, they should go for two. Well, he's not going to reach there. I think that's out. I think that is out. Aziz Ansari, looking to get back on strike, has perished. They have to get to at least 85, 90 runs from here, Shoaib. Short ball, pull. That's gone the distance. Akib Ashraf, what a clean hit. Well, he's bulky, he's tall. He's They'll want to cross 90. And DP under pressure. Oh, he's bowled him. Well, that slower, loopy delivery just does not bounce on this wicket, Shoaib. Ah, oh, swing and a miss. Darshan Pagrani didn't get hit for a six in that over. So that's the scorecard for Larry Kings. Nile scoring 20 of 17, 15 from Ali and 28 from Aziz Ansari. He was the man who kept the innings together for Larry Kings.
and with the help of three extras, which has been a good bowling performance from VTAC Volts, they've gotten to 83 in the 10 overs. A good bowling performance as well. Akshay Jyotin, just the 10 runs in his two overs, picked up a wicket. Mohammad Ajmal didn't bowl a second over, but gave three in his solitary over. And the youngsters, Arman Sajnani and Darshan Pagrani, picking up two wickets each in their two overs. A clan header conceded nine. Picked up two quick wickets. VTAC Walls will need 84 runs in the 10 overs. Well, good evening, ladies and gentlemen. And welcome back to the fan code DCC X10. Well, the openers are out. It's Mazar opening the batting along with Ryan Rashid. So to say, but this is a great platform for players like these. Oh, what a start. What a start. Emil Joseph has bowled an in-swinger. This is a good start from the Liari Kings. This one is absolutely perfect. He's done it again. It's an exact replay of the first dismissal. Two for two. VTAC Walls in a lot of trouble now. Just gathered whatever gear he could and walked in. Oh, he's bowled him! Perfect, perfect delivery. Shoaib Ahmed right next to me had called it. He had called it off air. I have to say this. That he's going to go first ball if it lands in the stumps. Shoaib Ahmed. Emil John. I think it's been a great start to the over. Oh, beautiful hit. This one from Mazar. Where did that come from? That was a cracking shot on the onside. Mazar Hussain was standing at the non-striking end. The in the fourth over, all three wickets fell in the very first over. Oh, he's picked it up nicely. It's gone sailing into the sevens dugouts. The VTAC waltz. Gayan goes for the big swing. This time beats the keeper. Will it hold up? No, it won't. It will hit the fence. And that slower delivery cut very hard. The point fielder makes a mistake. And they get a boundary. Aziz Ansari. One bad over from here. And the equation will change dramatically. Pulled from outside off stump. Oh, it's poor fielding again. And you're thinking, should I have gone for another over? Instead, that ball has gone out of the stadium, out of the park, into the trees. Mazar Hussain has to restrict in this over. Again, outside off some. This time, he'll get a boundary. Mazar Hussain is playing a sublime knock. Has played for very, very long time here at the seventh. This time the ball has gone in the air. And that is the game. What a way to finish the, no one, finish the match. And what a way to get your half century. Mazar Hussain, take a bow. But what, what a knock. What a knock. Absolutely. Unbelievable run chase. Especially after that first over debacle. Three wickets for two runs. And we thought the writing was on the wall for the VTAC vaults. That's the batting card right there. And it's just two people you need to talk about. Mazar Hussain, 50 of 29. Vinan, 16 of 17. And then the third person you really have to talk about is the bowler, Emil, who picked up three wickets in the first over. Kes, for me, they've lost the game on the extra 16. Given away, the second highest run scorer. Yeah, I agree. I agree, Abdul. Uh, that's a look at the bowling card. Uh so that's the game number two. Leari Kings, 83, batting first. Aziz Ansari, 28 of 11. Nile Mohammed, the captain, 20 of 17. And two wickets each for Saklain, Darshan Pagrani and Arman Sajnani. And then in the chase, it was Mazar Hussain and Vinan Nair who took the team home. 50 not out for Mazar Hussain and Emil. Three wickets in his first over. But no other bowler stepped up. Vitek Walls winning this game by seven wickets.